Well, um, I want to thank Diane, and I just want to tell the people of the city of Boston, you have the best theater director in the world, I mean, as director of ART. And I want to thank Professor Gates, who is always there, you know, for us, no matter what kind of movie, no matter how controversial, he's there to give us an opinion, to help us, and also to tell us when we're wrong. It's a privilege to have worked with the storytellers that I've gotten to work with, Quentin Tarantino, Lee Daniels, Ryan Coogler. I did a trilogy of South African movies, starting with Serafina, Cry the Beloved Country, and Mandela, Long Walk to Freedom. And I had the privilege of working with Oprah Winfrey on Lee Daniels, The Butler. I always love it, Lee Daniels, The Butler. That's another story. But uh, <laughs> one that Warner Brothers lost. But anyhow, uh, <laughs> who's counting? The, uh, uh, I do want to say that you know that movie broke all sorts of box office records. And there are always milestones that one goes after. And in this case, it was always the international marketplace. People would always say to me, a movie about black people will not work internationally. Well, there are two theories on why Lee Daniels the butler did over $75 million internationally. Theory number one, great movie, great story. I believe in that. Theory number two, I made Oprah Winfrey do 68 interviews in one day. <laughs> <laughs> that worked, right? <laughs> I'll pay for that, too. <laughs> I want to tell you that, uh, for me, um, being at Harvard is amazing. As I always tell Diane, my mom's 87 years old. She wanted us to be doctors and lawyers, and look what happened. And now I can tell her honestly, hey, mom, I got an award at Harvard. <laughs> <laughs> My dad uh, left us when we were younger, but he was the greatest dad you could ever have. And um, uh, two things, he taught us you know, to always fight injustice and fight for what you believe. So I'm gonna give you the motto of our company for all these years. It's a paraphrase of Kurt Vonnegut's uh, Cat's Cradle. Good can triumph over evil if the angels are as organized as the mafia. <laughs> to Congressman Lewis, Steve McQueen, and everybody on this panel, and especially Harry Belafonte, when the dust flies, I'll be right there with you. Thank you. Uh -huh.